With the design of the gallery, we really need lighting to be the hero of the space. So to a degree, we're creating a canvas in which the lighting can sit upon. My name's Angus Henderson. I'm the founder of Henderson & Co. And we were the lead designer and architect for the S showroom in Surrey Hills. The S showroom sits within a heritage building on the corner of Burke and Favreau. We made an effort to really black out or have a defensive attitude for the showroom towards the street. So that first interaction with the end user would be one of a surprise. So the brief for the S showroom here was to really create something that featured the high quality XAL lighting range. Now, typically in projects, lighting can be overused. The beautiful thing about this product was how we can use less luminaires to really beautifully create well-lit spaces. Part of the brief was to create a range of zones within the gallery itself. We have the lounge, which is a really calming residential type focus space. If you walk straight on, you're greeted by an island bench, almost as a workbench for where products can be tested and explored. Behind that sits another bench, which doubles as a bar space for events and get togethers for the design community. Turning to the right, that takes us to the Est showroom boardroom. This is a great location for designers to use the S space and go through any products and project specifications they may have. The remaining spaces that sit to the rear of the property are the staff kitchen, storage, and the bathroom itself. As far as the aesthetic outcome of the project, we wanted to find an intersection between a space not dissimilar to an art gallery and that of a high-end residential home. So having a restrained approach to the materials was key. In the creation of the lounge space, we wanted something that was truly immersive. We picked the color of this Royal Navy blue and we found it was a real serene color that best described and highlighted the lighting we wanted to use. Through the silk carpets, the Italian stucco to the walls, the velvet curtains, the black joinery punctuated with gray mirror and the boucle fabric on the custom lounges. This is a space where you can really unwind and look at the best of S Lighting's offering. So set at the heart of the gallery space, we have this collaborative work zone featured in an axolotl clad island bench. The junction between the axolotl glass and the stone bench tops is a brushed stainless steel. There's a soft delineation between the main gallery and the boardroom itself in the white sheer curtain. That space is grounded by a black timber table. We also created some high level storage with ladder like access to create a space that feels aesthetically pleasing, however, very pragmatic and functional. The bathroom space touches on this brand color that was used for the show of that Royal Navy blue with the tiling lining the walls the grey terrazzo mimicking the concrete used in the main gallery space, reeded glass to create soft visual movement, to the custom mirrors that are both edge lit and front lit, creating the most flattering lighting effects for the end user. There's a lot of consideration to the lounge space and the lighting effects that are seen within it. Some key pieces here are the Spio. It's unobtrusive and minimalist and flush set. They also offer fantastic support lighting to the feature lights from Christopher Boots. The key corridor space is lit by the Unicom by XAL product. This allows for a range of different optics within one luminaire. Another key product in the gallery space is the Move It system by XAL. In the boardroom, we find a really interesting product family called Beto by XAL. 
Now this product is for anyone who's looking for something that has anti-fatigue characteristics to it. One of the most rewarding things in the creation of this gallery for S Lighting was the ability to collaborate with so many great experts. One of my favorite parts of this gallery space is to be able to step into the lounge, pour a drink, sit back and relax.